Hey guys, me Sir Potato, Lord Potato, whatever, Sir Potato here again. I'm going to show you how to build a great shrine, temple, thingamajig. It, you need a beacon though. Um, yeah, so let's get right into this. I'm going to use iron blocks, and I am in creative because I'm not going to waste my time doing it in survival. You're going to be a 9 by 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So you need a 9 by 9 of just iron blocks. You guys know what beacons are, but maybe not because nobody really plays Minecraft anymore. But, I mean, some people still do, like me... And me and other people, like, I don't know, YouTubers, but we're just going to keep filling this in until we get a 3x3. Three three. That's all you have to do to make the secondary source. Now, you don't need the secondary source. I just like to have it because it's big. A lot more time consuming, but will look cool. Er, if that's even a word. But yeah, so that's all I'm gonna do right now. I know I haven't been uploading. Yesterday was like my first upload in a long time. And by the way, Happy Chinese New Year, people who celebrate it. I know it's Chinese New Year today, cause. I just do. Well, I know because we don't have school. And there we, go, there we go. We just finished our little temple shrine thing. There we go. All right, now let me just put in some stuff. There we go. To make this cool-looking shrine even cooler or thingamajig, just fill them out like this. And now you never want to build over the beam, because, um, hold on. Yeah, there we go. We'll cut off, so you never want that to happen. But you, you're you just going to keep doing this to make, like, a cool little box temple. And then, personally, for me, I like the color blue, so I'm going to make it blue. And that's not blue, I meant this color, blue. You can put some colored glass stains because it will change the beam. Uh, I think I'm going to go with the light blue. Yeah, light blue will look better. Anyways, uh, you don't have to change the color. Just, I like to change the color, you don't. And then I'm going to surround this with blue glass. And I meant like that to make it like you know you can't really change it so if you're in survival and doing this be careful because you cannot obtain glass again maybe from a silk touch but you're just going to keep building on the sides to make a cool little temple and uh, you want to make it one two three four five blocks tall i don't know math so um yeah, and then you you just pillar it up, just like this. There we go. Mm, it's taking so long. I'm sorry. Uh, you could use different blocks for it. I'm just using iron, time consuming. And yeah, and that's how you make a cool little temple looking thing. That goes for a beacon. You could mess with it even more like putting like these, you know, to make it like more, to like make it look more realistic, like it's stable, like digged underground, you know. Yeah, see, it looks much better, kind of. I don't know, I'll add in some tips. I I'm just going like adding on random stuff. You don't have to add these. Just the first part I showed you is good enough, but yeah, this is a lot of iron blocks if we're trying to obtain this in survival. 
and take you a long time. And there you go, look. Got that, I made it. Um, still good, I guess. Yeah. Ugh, I, I really do not like lag, but I'm trying to get to third person view so I can, you know, do say goodbye and everything. Third front, there we go. Anyways, I hope you enjoy the video of me making this awesome shrine, temple looking thing for your beacon. Uh, please comment, like, sus this is happening again. Subscribe. Uh, anyways, if you have any tips, put them in the comments. Also, hope you enjoyed this build. Bye.